whenever I visit the Golan Heights and stand at Mitz Bay Gadot, also known as Mortefa, I am in awe of the breathtaking beauty of the Hula Valley. It is difficult for me to convey to my tourists that this idyllic place was once a battleground and that the children living in the kibbutzim in the valley had to take shelter for days to avoid Syrian shelling. To fully convey the emotional experiences of the past, I often turn to music. As we stand in front of Kibbutz Gadot in the valley, I often recall the song My Daughter, Are You Crying or Laughing? 1958, after the heavy shelling of the kibbutz and the destruction of many homes. A group of volunteers came to aid the members of the kibbutz, including a young man named Yoveb Katz, who was deeply moved by the resilience of the people of Gadot, particularly the children who had to take shelter. Nine years later, on June 10, 1967 while at the vastness of the Sinai Desert, Yovev Katz, now dressed in the uniform of an IDF officer, heard the news of the occupation of the Golan Heights and the removal of the threat from the people of the Hula Valley. This event inspired him to write the song that has become an anthem of hope. I would like to share this poem with you for a better understanding of the meaning of the Golan Heights for Israel. If a picture is worth 1,000 words, how much is worth a poem? Thank you.